Hi everyone. Thanks so much for watching my video. I, this is my new um, adventure. I'm new to the YouTube community and my channel is For the Love of Crafting. I've been a journaler uh, since early middle school. And I've been watching um, crafting videos um, forever. So this will be our first introduction. Um, thank you for allowing me to um, be part of this journey. So this first journal, it comes from the love of teddy bears. Uh, this is hands on teddy bear. Some of the digital kits in this journal are from Mrs. Cog's uh, Craft and Country at Heart. So this is Country at Heart with flowers. <clears throat> the digital printout um, had purple flowers and I just happen to have purple flowers that I tacked on to get that 3D look. So I hope that lighting is not too bright. Just love this teddy bear. Uh, this is Country at Heart um, printouts. I think this one is for Mrs. Cog's <laughs> digital kit. Uh, this plastic uh, pocket came from a kit that I used to, a monthly kit I would get for years. Uh, there, she no longer sells her kits. Um, I'll have to think of the name of who, who it is. I believe she only does digital printouts now, but I'll make sure to post that. Uh, but I've had three years of monthly kits that I'm going to leverage in my future journals. This journal has a lot of writing, room space, a lot of room to write, sorry, uh, or add any additional em em embellishments or memory. Keeps. That was my goal. Uh, since I've been a lifelong journaler, I love writing. <clears throat> and want the space for that. Uh, this journal also has tabs, different kinds of tabs. Um, there's some stamping and some of these pages, a lot of these are tea dyed, coffee dyed, and stamped. I love the lace and fabric paper look. Mrs. Cog's printables. I love a lot of these statements. They're just so cute. Side pocket. These came in a four page, or one page with four different designs from Country at Heart. These just love the antique look. These came from the photo cube. Maps came from Baraka Inc. B E R A C A Inc. Mrs. Cog's printables. This says, Let Your Worries Fly Away, which I tend to do when I craft more 
of the digital prints from Mrs. Cogs. Just some rim do, right? Side pocket. Sorry, I keep, you can tell I'm a first timer. Trying to make sure I stay in on screen. This is another digital print that you can use to write in. As you can see, some of these, they're just tea dyed. This is a um, stamp. Just a little tab there. Another postcard from Country at Heart. The paper clips. I just love this idea. I saw it on Mrs. Cog's um, videos and just love folding the ends of those. Another lace, Mrs. Cog's prints, teddy bear prints. This journal also has um, antique lace. So this is, uh, was part of a larger lace and the corner of it was torn. So I figured I'd just make smaller pieces. came from a shop. I'll have to look at the name. It was a box full of just different cutouts of these. I think there were curtain. I'll have to think of it. I'll, I'll put it on the description love this image. <clears throat> Corner. Oh, in there. Tab. I like the idea of writing sideways on this one. I was torn between putting it the other way, uh, but I've seen people journal sideways and I thought, oh, that would be a good idea. Some stamping, doily. This is avocado dyed doily. This digital Printout is, I believe, for Mrs. Cogs. Mrs. Cogs teddy bear printout. Journaling card. Just love that little teddy bear. And this is just pockets that you could tuck stuff in here. I took this from my own personal journal. Tuck spot. This is tracing paper, tea dyed. Some charms here. This washi tape is from the same where I got this pocket, so I'll just have to think of put, put the name on there. Some more writing cards. Another tag.
this is part of Mrs. Cog's digital print. I sewed in some ribbon and this is a paper clip with ribbon. I just love that 3D look bow. It's so cute. Tuck spot with another tag. These are these are papers cardstock that I've had for years. So excited to use a lot of the cardstock that I've accumulated. Another Mrs. Cog's printable. Just love the color color palette it's just an envelope with some writing cards another card oh and tag Sort of folded the teddy bear you can write on. This was my my template for teddy bears that I sewn. Some tags. This is a fold out teddy bear tag in it. Love the colorful map. This is from Baraka Ink cardstock envelope. lace border just a pocket tuck just love these Another Mrs. Cog's, part of Mrs. Cog's teddy bear. Printables, envelope. I need some of these. Two by envelope with the writing cardstock in there. Just love flipping these pages. Some lace, new lace, new lace. So this came from an antique lace that was part of a grab bag. So I cut some of these pieces. And incorporated it here. It's 
another tag. Just love how the colors work together. It's such a cute pictures. They're all cute. So this is a lip material, new beaded lace there, and a tag with the little charm there. Uh, in this journal, um, I followed Mrs. Cog's um, tutorial on the binding using the Vine Tech material and the glues. Um, so again, I this is a nine by five and a half. Until next time, I'm almost done with the second teddy bear um, journal. I'll upload that as soon as I can. Thank you again for watching, um, watching me uh, stumble through my first video. Uh, thanks for watching. Until next time.